Good day, beautiful soul. Matt here, and welcome to another session on Intention Inspired. Our current community intention is all about wealth, money, and abundance. That is the journey that we have been on. So today, let us continue this journey by focusing on internalizing some timeless principles of wealth creation so that we can build more financial resilience and prosperity. Today's session is inspired by George Klassen's wisdom, a man who revolutionized our understanding of wealth creation in his book, The Richest Man in Babylon. As we dive into the essence of his words, we'll discover that wealth creation and prosperity, like a tree, requires time and nurturing to grow. So today we'll explore ways to plant seeds of financial health and wealth to nourish prosperity with consistent savings, and to cultivate positive self-beliefs that naturally promote beneficial financial choices. So let's kick it off. George Klassen says in his book, wealth like a tree grows from a tiny seed. The first copper you save is the seed from which your tree of wealth shall grow. The sooner you plant that seed, the sooner shall the tree grow. And the more faithfully you nourish and water that seed with consistent savings, the sooner may you bask in the contentment beneath its shade. There's a study titled Self-Esteem, Financial Knowledge, and Financial Behavior, where researchers shed light on how our self-perception impacts our financial decisions. And this study helped us discover that self-esteem is significantly related to individual financial behaviors. So the key takeaway is that positive self-beliefs encourage informed and beneficial financial choices. So today, let us challenge any negative self-beliefs we have about money and reinforce our confidence in managing our finances. We have the power to cultivate financial resilience and prosperity. So let's cultivate this by practicing with a short meditation. Let's take a moment to settle into the present, finding comfort in our posture. Closing the eyes gently, allowing a deep inhale to fill your lungs. And as you exhale, releasing tension from the body. We're here today to explore and cultivate our own sense of prosperity, to build our resilience against the currents of financial stress or worry, bringing our attention to the breath. We feel the air entering through our nose, filling our lungs and gently leaving the body. Just noticing and feeling the rise and fall of our chest as we breathe in and out. Now visualizing a small seed in the palm of our hand this seed symbolizes our financial health, our potential for more spacious abundance. As we plant the seed in fertile soil, we nourish it, we care for it, we have patience. With consistency, these are the hallmarks of our financial 
resilience, nourishment, patience, consistency. As the seed receives all that it needs, it begins to sprout and grow. With each breath, we can imagine our seed sprouting, working its way into the earth, sinking its roots deep, growing slowly, steadily, patiently into a stronger, taller, beautiful, sturdy tree. This is our tree of prosperity. And just like this tree, our financial resilience grows from small beginnings, simple intentions, nurtured by wise choices, powerful, consistent, committed actions. So we enjoy hearing the leaves in the wind Enjoying how the leaves filter the sunlight. These leaves are like the tree's blessings, each one a testament to our ability to make good financial decisions, to save our money, to invest it, and to live within our means. The fruit of this tree represents our achieved goals the results of our hard work and our commitment. The deep roots of this tree symbolize our skills and our knowledge, while the sturdy trunk stands for our resilience and determination. Breathing in deeply, feeling the strength of this tree Our prosperity tree stands tall and strong, its branches reaching out, its roots going deep. This tree is a symbol of our potential for wealth and financial stability. Continuing to deepen our breath, feel free to repeat the mantra, I am a vessel of abundant prosperity. Letting these words sink in, I am a vessel of abundant prosperity. Allowing this feeling of abundance to fill your entire being. Our ability to cultivate prosperity is ever abundant within us. As we continue to nourish our tree of prosperity, so too will our financial resilience grow. Holding this image in our heart, letting it guide our actions and decisions. As we bring this short visualization to a close, bringing our awareness back to our breath, back to our body, beginning to integrate our abundant tree into our day, noticing this sense of peace and calm that has settled within. Gently bringing some movement back into our body, awakening this body, slowly opening the eyes. Let us carry this image of our prosperity tree and these feelings of abundance with us into the day. May peace, resilience, and prosperity that you've cultivated in your practice today guide our actions and decisions into the world.
invitation today to write a thank you note to money, acknowledging its role in our life. This is just a fun way to show gratitude for our financial blessings that we have already, no matter how small or how big. It's just so healthy to cultivate that fertile soil of manifestation by acknowledging the journey that we have been on and appreciate the steps that we have already taken towards financial prosperity. As we do this, we may notice the critic that we have who shares doubts and fears. So let's investigate our financial shadows for a moment. Are there patterns of scarcity or victimhood you're noticing in your financial life? We can just note these without judgment. The process is to practice allowing, accepting, and embracing, nurturing these patterns. By bringing awareness to them, we naturally dissolve them as we invite our more abundant self to bring some compassion into the mix. We can thank these parts of us that, that have concern and reassure them that we're taking proactive steps towards our financial resilience. And in this way, we heal our relationship with money. We release blocks that we have. We notice ways to pivot and merge into more financial abundance. Now reflecting on some financial decisions, patterns that have served us well, what insights do they reveal? And how can we apply these insights into our decisions today? If you have a jar, some water, and some salt nearby, let's perform a symbolic release of our financial worries or limiting beliefs. We can start by filling up our jar with water. This represents our mind. Adding a pinch of salt, this symbolizes our worries and limiting beliefs. Allowing the salt to dissolve, this signifies the release and transformation of these concerns into growth and prosperity. And may this ritual support our intention to cultivate prosperity and financial resilience. Wrapping up today's session with an affirmation, feel free to repeat after me. I enjoy the steady journey of financial prosperity. Kudos. Thank you so much for joining me on today's session. Thank you for embracing the journey towards financial prosperity with me today. I can feel our wealth growing every day as we continue to consistently realign with the prosperous and more abundant parts of ourselves. I'm so curious what you discovered about your abundantly prosperous self today. What might be one single takeaway you're excited to implement into your day today? I'd love to hear from you in our community activity feed. Feel free to pop on over to intentioninspired.com, join the community conversation. And I so look forward to checking in with you tomorrow as we continue our journey towards financial abundance, wealth, prosperity. <laughs>